Welcome, welcome back to my channel, you guys. If you're new to this channel, I'm Michelle, and here we do all things DIY, such as this hairstyle here, sis. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. Um, I tried to make this hairstyle as easy as possible. It was super easy, like, you don't even need to know, like, how to do the three-strand braid because I use the rubber band method, so if you have problems, like, with your gripping, I got you. I got you <laughs> so yeah um, this style took me like five hours it's it was quick that includes like the parting and doing my hair and yeah I was being a little lazy so I would have I know I would have finished in like in like a short time but anyone can finish can definitely finish this hairstyle in about five hours and you guys I am totally in love with the results I really am I really am I love I love this color I love it I was doubting it but but uh, I love it <laughs> anyway you guys without further ado let's get into this video so I'm starting off with freshly washed and stretched hair and what you're gonna need is the braiding hair a red tail comb rubber bands and two mirrors like one in the front and one so you can see in the back so i'm starting off by sectioning from ear to ear in the back and that's going to be my first section i'm checking with the mirror to see if my line is straight and fixing it if it's not tying away the other section and i decided to rubber band the sections i wanted before like i started braiding and i'm using the iso plus now to sleek it out and make it smooth i'm making a diagonal part and putting in the braiding here in the middle of the diagonal part taking the rubber band and tying my hair to secure the braiding here that's in the middle as well as secure my hair so that it goes nowhere splitting my hair in two sections as well and then you begin to twist and also guys as you twist don't forget to like put like the edge gel on the ends of your hair as well so that it doesn't stick out so that your natural hair doesn't stick out well whether you have natural <laughs> Or relaxed well I have natural so I put the edge control so that the hair stays laid yeah so pretty much guys that's the method I'm gonna be using the whole head and if I have something I have to tell you I'm gonna come back and let you know enjoy the video guys and thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe okay okay <laughs> I also used the brick layering parting method so that my braids fall flat in between each other and not on top of each other. So you guys can keep that in mind when you do your hair at home.
So I was on my last section and I was like, oh, it's the growth for me, love. And I'm all done. Oh, guys, I love how these came out like so very much. The best part of it all. Oh, it's so soothing. It is really soothing. So this is the finished look guys, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Did I do a good job? Did I explain well? Do you think it's easy? Are you gonna try it? Let me know in the comment section down below how you like it and if you try it out, let me know. Follow me on Instagram at shells underscore natural and let me know, tag me if you recreate the style, you know. And don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and thank you guys for watching. Stay blessed y'all. Peace. I'm out.